Hello and welcome everyone to Victoria 2, Heart of Darkness. Um, and you may have seen from the title, I am playing as Croatia. Now, in order to do this, you have to start out as Austria, um, and then go in and just select Release Nations, select Croatia, and then click Play As. Um, there are a little, little nation here on the coast of the Adriatic Sea. Um, neighbors of Austria... Uh, and the Ottoman Empire, and then Ocean to the West Coast, um, and then Montenegro down here. Um, now, I thought this would be kind of a cool way to play a European-style nation without having to play one of the big boys. Um, maybe to be kind of more of a, a role-playing type of country or nation. Um, we still could possibly have a scramble for, Af for Africa somehow, some way, I'm sure. Um, but first things first... Um, let's get things sorted out here. We're going to raise taxes just to kind of start out with to 75% um, for the middle and lower classes. Um, drop the upper class down. Um, we're still losing five a turn. Let's just put them up to max for now. Um, then we can drop education efficiency down a little bit. Um, research we are going to need to get some railroads. Um, so let's go ahead and pick those up. Uh, and then for this, we could use with some more, yeah. Um, our literacy rate's only 11% for a, for a country of only 500,000 isn't all that great. Um, I I am going to go ahead and declare war on, well not declare war, but we're going to justify a conquest on Montenegro um, to get that going. Um, I do not believe they're in anyone, they're not a lot allied with anyone and they're not in anyone's sphere yet, it's too early. Um, so it's going to depend on kind of how quickly we get spotted, and there you go, we've been spotted. <laughs> um, other possible military targets eventually. Um, for Croatia, I think we're probably going to have to get big enough to wear um, the Ionian Islands, Greece, um, if we can pick up some some of Africa over in here. Um, Egypt is going to be a big target, and then down over here into the Middle East. Um, we want to be, we want to stay close friends with our former parent, well this is basically our parents, um, Austria. Now, and we also want to become friends with the UK, um, because we're going to maybe want to take territory for the Ottoman Empire. Um, you do have a decision as Croatia to form Yugoslavia. Um, you just need um, form all the core provinces must be true owned by um, what are the Yugoslav uh, basically you have to own I mean all of the major things, but you can form Yugoslavia, so I'm going to be trying to do that. Um, let's kick up education efficiency up to seven. There we go. Uh, okay, so we still have our little... are you moving or no? Why does it take you so long? It appears to be some sort of glitch. They're in Zagreb. Move. Yep, that's definitely a glitch of some sort. Because we can't build any other armies. And if those guys can't move... I mean, they're fully supplied, so we shouldn't have any problems there. It appears as if they just stay stuck there. Huh. Well, let's disband you. But now I can't build an army. I'm going to switch to encourage soldiers in Croatia. Maybe that will help me out. 
Yep, they're still not getting help from anyone. There we go. Alright, so... Um, five and five. Four and four. Six and five. We want... Let's just get two infantry for now. Eh, not two infantry. Let's get a artillery. Now, hopefully that won't be bugged out. Let's keep on increasing our relations. No, we don't have any allies. And I don't think anyone is even actually influencing us. Ah, the Ottomans are. Alright, so we got our soldiers. We'll be ready in 80 days. Railroad's about halfway done. So, uh, 70, 71st ranked. Population's growing pretty steadily as well. Uh, maybe when Italy forms too, we can join up with them. A little bit allied up there. Okay, infantry is about to go in Zagreb. Will you be able to move? Hey, you can move. Looky there. Alright, so we've got that bug figured out. Uh, must just be when you release nations that they're armies. Or maybe it's just a Croatian bug. I'm not too sure. Go get your organization up. Other army, come on down. Um, let's increase. Ooh. It says we're losing money. I don't know how we're gaining. But hey, what the hey? Let's go ahead and raise that all the way up. Okay, you're both there. Can I build another one? No. Okay. You have three. Let's go ahead. Declare war via conquest. We're now at war with Montenegro. Go ahead and move in. We should be able to squash them. Hopefully. Yep. And now the siege commences. We're going to have our first first conquest on the first episode um, after <laughs> that was the easy one now we have to kinda decide where we want to go from there the Ionian Islands are gonna be uh, yeah they're in they're basically Great Britain uh, so is Greece so Egypt could be a tasty little target if we can get enough soldiers and that sort of thing um, Tuscany is going to be influenced by them. You two Sicilies. They will not accept an alliance, but I want to be better friends with them anyway. So we'll get that going. We're 21% done in here. Let's keep zooming in. Now, what is there? Ooh, they have fruit. Hmm, I never would have guessed. Oh, there's a Yugoslav. Okay, so we're gonna have to take a lot of a lot of things from the Ottomans in order to to get what I want. Uh, commerce. Let's go ahead and pick up engineers. Yeah, the Ottomans are gonna have a pretty big force. Yeah, a lot of wars in South America. With Mexico helping out Colombia. Hmm. And I don't like how the Ottomans have troops on my borders. That kind of scares me. I mean, the nice thing about Croatia being released is I'm, I'm not an uncivilized nation. Um, you can obviously tell that I'm civilized, so I don't have to wait that 50 years of trying to get things figured out, sorted. 
um, in Tunis. I could establish a protectorate. Um, that might be our next route we look. Um, if we can afford to get boats and all that sort of stuff. But that's thinking a wee bit ahead. They will not accept peace. Because I don't have a war score over them yet, technically. End of the first year. We've almost got our conflicts. We've moved up. We were at 71st rank, now we're 47th. Thanks to our mighty military. 10% left in the Montenegrin territories. Um, let's go ahead and switch the national focus over to clergymen. Back to clergymen. we got to get that percentage up to 2 and boom all right let's go ahead and annex Montenegro there we go accepted um, we'll send them off to split and we have completed our first military conquest guys so I'm going to leave it off there. If you have any sort of territorial gains ideas that you would like to share with me down in the comments below, it would be greatly appreciated. Other than that, thank you very much for watching. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, um, over at TDog082, make sure to do that. Um, and if you're not subscribed to the Roundtable uh, HD here, make sure to also subscribe here um, for more of the Croatian save. So yet again, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I will talk to you later.